La grand messe de la téléphonie mobile se tient cette semaine à Barcelone. L'occasion de découvrir les technologies de demain, comme pratiquer des interventions chirurgicales à distance, tester des applications qui vous identifient grâce à vos battements du cœur ou ne pas perdre le signal de son téléphone dans un ascenseur. Tout cela ressemble plus ou moins à de la science-fiction, mais c'est plus proche qu'on ne l'imagine. Le Mobile World Congress a fixé l'émergence de la 6G pour 2030. L'Agence spatiale européenne s'y intéresse déjà. When I first made the proposal, people were shocked because they said 6G is not defined. How are you going to launch a satellite if we don't know what, uh, what it will be? And uh, my answer to that is that we don't know. We want to contribute to the definition of 5G. What we do know is a certain number of uh, technologies and building blocks. And with that, we are building an experimental uh, satellite. It's like a laboratory that instead of being on ground, it is important that it's up in the orbit uh, so that we can uh, test in a realistic way against uh, the terrestrial network so, and together with the terrestrial network. La 6G permettra de multiplier par 10 la vitesse de transmission des données par rapport à la 5G. Selon les experts, cette accélération constituera un levier pour réduire la consommation d'énergie et ainsi développer un avenir numérique plus vert et durable. Manually data and this uh, and putting a lot of uh, uh, time into this uh, process. To be honest, uh, still in the early stage, uh, but Huawei already started investing on 6G since 2017, when the 5G still not start commercial deployment. Okay, so uh, still debate on the features, architectures, but one thing is clear. 6G is more than communications. La 6G va représenter un nouveau dilemme pour la sécurité et la protection des données personnelles. We are going into a new era where uh, things will be more automated, which means they will be less attended, let's say, from uh, humans. Um, and therefore, you need to make sure that uh, this The points of reference are protected. 6G will allow us to fully integrate into virtual worlds like this holographic communication, pushing the boundaries of digital to new extremes we can't even imagine yet. Marta Rodriguez in Barcelona for Euronews.